हेलो हे गाइज वेलकम टू कॉन्सेप्ट एंड कोडिंग एंड दिस इज श्रेयांश जैन एंड टूडेज वीडियो इज गोइंग टू बी वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर दोज हु आर न्यू टू दिस चैनल एंड फॉर दोज हु आर ऑलरेडी फॉलोइंग दिस चैनल फॉर एल एल डी एंड एच एल डी बिकॉज टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू अबाउट द रोड मैप द फ्यूचर प्लान फॉर दिस प्ले लिस्ट लाइक वॉट वी हैव कवर्ड वॉट वी आर गोइंग टू कवर वॉट आर द टॉपिक्स विच वी हैव टू कवर सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द लो लेवल डिजाइन रोड मैप so currently the prerequisite for the low level design is definitely the oops fundamental right so if you aware of what is inheritance polymorphism abstraction you are good with the low level design right any language c++ java python all are good any oops any oops language is good to go for the low level design right second what is the second uh, step after oops fundamental that which is the prerequisite the second is start with the solid principle so if you are following my lld playlist you will know that solid principle i have put at number 1 right so solid is always the number 1 and it is give you a base right what is exactly oops principles after that here comes our design patterns right so we have total 23 design patterns and i have covered this all green tick marks and this green tick mark question marks i have covered so my way of teaching is i don't want to cover all 23 design patterns and then start with the questions my way of teaching is like i covered few important design patterns and the questions can be solved on top of it so there are certain questions which can be solved directly using the design patterns like notify me pizza system right here if you see the vending machine file system atm so there are certain question which can be solved directly via patterns but there are question in which you use those patterns right so this is my way of teaching like instead of putting all design patterns and then go for questions i covered some important design pattern and then solved questions on top of it right and i will follow the same for the rest of the design patterns which are pending and similarly the questions which are pending i will use the design patterns right as far as we cover so till now if you see that the questions which i have covered and one more thing i want to tell you that these questions are not something which i have come up with myself these questions these all questions has been asked in an interview i will refrain from taking the name of the companies in which these question asked but you can just search with the name question name and see in which companies it has been asked you will get a lot all good product based companies this question has been asked in any one of the top product based companies some of the question i got from you guys some of the question i have come up after my analysis like in which company this which company is asking what ld question so if you see that notify me very important pizza billing system parking lot very important snake and ladder elevator system car rental system like logging system tic tac to game book my show currency handling vending machine atm chess game file system split wise very very important so till now we have covered all those things now what's the future if you see that this is the up next split wise simplify algorithm this is very very important from lnd perspective plus dsa interview question also we have to implement also right so this is very very important then if you see that this is the list of the questions which i am going to cover please go through it and any questions left or you think there is another question which i haven't included it feel free to ping me on comment i will definitely go through it and add it into the bucket list right so this is something i have put in the note so what i have meant is like the sequencing of the videos like here if you see that the future videos what the uh, future in which this video videos i am going to cover the sequencing might be different like what i have listed here so let's say listed after a split wise simplify algorithm i have put design crick bus it is possible that i might cover some other question before crick bus depending upon the priority let's say if anybody has certain interview in some companies and any question which has been frequently asked and if they request like 
then I should uh, consider that let's cover those first. So depending upon the bandwidth, depending upon the priority, so the sequencing to cover this question can be changed. So that just a heads up guys. So, but my pattern of teaching will be same. I'm going to cover some design patterns and then I will solve a questions on top of it. Okay. So this is low level design. And one more thing guys, there is no course for low level design like we have in HLD. Right. So HL, low level design is different from HLD is like there is no course chapter one, chapter two, chapter three, nothing. Right. So and there is no one correct answer. So that's why I follow this structured manner so that it can be learned in a sequential manner and important for the interview also. All from this is all everything is from the interview perspective guys. So now let's come to the HLD. So as I told you, it is different from LLD like why? Because here we have to first learn some concept before even we are able to solve the questions. For example, you cannot, if you don't know consistent hashing, you cannot come up with an interview in something similar to consistent hashing, right? You have to know this technology before. So that's why the, the questions, if you see that the bigger questions certainly lies at the bottom of the high level design. But if you see that there are certain questions which lie at the top also, right? So here, if you see that certain question lie on the top also. So the, my pattern of teaching is same. As soon as I will cover the topics, I will solve the questions based on it. But if certain topics are left, which has to be learned before solving the question. So that's why questions are at little bit bottom. So now in the HLD, this again, green ones I have covered, right? So here, if you see that, uh, this are base, what is TCP, web socket, HTTP, web RTC, client server and peer to peer architecture. What's the difference? Cap theorem, very important, right? Microservices design pattern here in this saga is very important, right? And strangler sometimes ask, sometimes not, but saga don't miss it, right? This is very important scale from zero to million user. Right. So based on top of it information, we have done it right and consistent hashing. I have taught. So these are all the topics With using this. I am teaching the topics and then we will solve the question. Right. So back of the envelope estimation is uh, very important. Many companies ask this one, like uh, how many servers you're going to need, how many memory you're going to need. We need to know the calculation. DynamoDB design key value store where we use consistent hashing. So that's why it's a sequential Se SQL versus no SQL, which DB to use very, very important design WhatsApp again, very important rate limiter, very important. So this is the upcoming video here, auto complete system, or we can also say the type ad system, right? But after that, what you can expect from the HLD. So we will cover the more HLD components, right? Like Kafka, queues, proxy server, CDN, storage type, block storage, file storage, S3, RAID, file system, Bloom filters, Merkle tree, Gaussian protocols, right? Caching. So these are the high level components, right? Or you can say that text, which we have to know because in when we will solve this question, right? We are going to use this one then how to scale database so horizontal vertical partitioning mirroring leader election indexing all this thing we should know then only we can be able to solve this question right so again guys here i will try i will not give any timeline because it's depend upon my bandwidth but i will try to cover as soon as possible these things but these are the roadmap which i am following for the high level and low level design but and i can pretty much tell you that you will not find this content on any of the paid contents also this kind of breadth and this kind of depth right so i hope you are enjoying the content and stay tuned and last those who stay till now i want to tell you that there is one more i want to tell you that latest update or you can say that news that i have started working on spring boot playlist man I'm listing down all the sequential wise videos I have to cover. And once I am done with this, most probably by Fab, I will be launching this playlist. 
and i hope that would help you more in your interviews right but let's but again i promise you that low level design and high level design focus will not going to uh, deviate it because of the spring boot playlist it's all just i have to manage but yes for sure these are more priorities and i am totally in line what we have to cover okay guys now i hope you know little bit how we are going where we are going in 2023 what all you can expect from this channel any feedback you have for me if something you have in your mind can be improved please share in the comment section i will definitely love to improvise like any feedback i can definitely enhance my content so i am open for the feedback guys so let's work together let's make don't pay for system design system design let it be what i say is like system design for all system design is free so let's continue work toward it have a good day guys and happy new year bye